Sup, sup, sup. My name is Ray for the Year Council. We got some more news on Tribe Force, which is basically an OCG exclusive set, if I remember right. And we got some Nero cloths, and they look pretty badass, honestly. I really do. I really am digging these. And then we have some of, um, I can't pronounce these guys. They are called Siriaiju or Yayu, uh, so, or Yui. So it's not along those lines. I'm just going to basically post it like this with the Y-U-U, if that's what it is, and, uh, you know, that, that's, they're, they're interesting to say the least, but let's start with the New York Clocks, and uh, this photo will be here for you to see, we're talking, I'm putting on the mouse on, I believe, the Colossus one, because obviously it's the only one that's bird, and it's a War Warrior Level 3 Ritual with 1200 attack and 2300 defense, you can Ritual summon this card with, obviously, a New York Cloth Ritual Spell card, and you can only use the effects of one, uh, the first and second effect once per turn. Now, the first effect reads, you can discard this card to add one of your cloth spell or trap card from your deck to your hand. And the second effect reads, during either player's turn, you can target one monster special summon from the extra deck. Until the end of the turn, its attack becomes zero, and its effects are negated. So that is... That is something that is extremely good for the deck without even knowing the deck that is extremely good. And now we have the Nero Cloth of Cataster. And yes, it actually says Cataster, which is kind of weird because it's a giant fucking shark looking thing. And I think everyone can pretty much agree with me on that. But anyway, Water Dragon Level 5, 2200, 1200 defense ritual. So basically, Cataster turned into a giant Water Dragon. And it must be ritual summoned by using other monsters other than the Nero Cloth of Cataster and cannot be special summoned by other ways. And I'm about to like just put a picture of a Water Dragon just so you guys can see what the fuck I'm talking about. Um, actual like living Water Dragon. It looks so much like it. Uh, anyway, you can discard this card from your hand to target a Nero Cloth monster in your graveyard, special summon that target. At the start of the damage step, if your Nero Cloth monster battles a monster special summon from the extra deck, destroy that monster immediately without applying damage calculation. Also really good. And then we are talking about this little Yayu over here, or Yui, however you want. There's no I there, so why am I saying Yui? Anyway, translation's a little off for me. Anyway, uh, once returned during each player's turn, you can banish one of these. Little, you can banish um, the, the little girl. Let's put it that way. And then you can banish one in your graveyard, apply the following effects. All these monsters gain X amount of attack. They're not fully sure. Translation, so I'm not there yet. And the girl Suki Win is basically if this card is no sign, you can target one of your banished Renju monsters and special summon that target. So I will leave a link down below so you guys can fully see it. And I think it's pretty freaking cool that Nero Cloth, especially that one right there, the uh, the the Colossus. Anyway, today has been an extremely busy day. A lot of surprises still yet to come today, and we're probably gonna finally start getting fucking back into normal schedules. I'm just excited to I drop the F bomb. So I will see you then. I'm ready for the year council. Thanks for watching. Until next time, rate, comment, subscribe, and peace.